Hey, welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to be telling you everything you need to know to ace the writing component of the Victorian Selective School exam. If you haven't already, make sure to like and subscribe down below and let's get started. Before we start, I just want to say that I didn't have to do the writing test because it got cancelled in 2021, but these are just some general tips that can help you in a writing test. I believe you are given 5 minutes for planning and 30 minutes for actually writing and you have to use a given prompt to write the piece. For creative writing, this can either be a written prompt or an image or sometimes even both. And for persuasive writing, this is usually a written prompt and sometimes some background information is given that you can use in your writing. One of the best things that you can do is to split your time up between the 30 minutes. For example, in persuasive writing, there's usually five paragraphs, introduction, three body paragraphs, and a conclusion. So if you have 30 minutes, you can split that up into six minutes each. So that will help you stay on track of time while doing your writing. Otherwise, it gets really hard to manage your time and before you know it, time's up and you've only gotten to the third or fourth paragraph. Another thing is to use good vocabulary. So that's always helpful. And that also helps in writing good and detailed descriptions, especially in your creative writing. The third thing is you don't want to mess up your grammar, your spelling, or your punctuation. These things are general things that should not be messed up and these should all be perfected. The last thing is to practice. You can do this by doing like three to four persuasive or creative writing pieces a week, like maybe two of each or something, and just keep on practicing until you feel like you can do good writing. Here are a couple of practice prompts that you can use for your own writing and to practice. In conclusion, writing is completely different to the other test since you can't exactly guess anything or work anything out. This just tests your own thinking and what you can write so it makes it quite difficult. Well that's it for today so subscribe and stay tuned for more videos.